Hey guys, what's up? Good morning. Welcome in with your pal, your friend, Mr. Knight, 5N. And I got to lend a voice to this and do a video on it because I'm very disturbed. I'm not shocked, but I'm very disturbed about it. So I watched a video from Geeks and Gamers and Jeremy discussed how the small penis thinking little troll monkey, Pablo Hidalgo, wanted to call out this fine gentleman right here, uh, Star Wars Theory, for his reaction of the last episode of The Mandalorian. I had a similar reaction. I blubbered like a little girl meeting the Jonas Brothers. And then R2-D2 came in, to, uh, in, in the scene and I was, I was spent. I was back in the couch. But what really bothers me is, is, is that an employee from Lucasfilm that is trying to create good content for Star Wars wants to call out fans like this and act like a little bitch. And it's, and it's just, it, it, it's not right. I mean, I, I hope to God when Jon Favreau or Dave Filoni takes over Lucasfilm, which I think is pretty much going to happen, uh, they get rid of people like this, man. Or they, you know, they, they at least say, hey, you cannot bash our fans for their reactions of their emotions. It's not right. And I also uh, watched the video from Star Wars Theory collecting his thoughts and responding to this. Now, I don't know where Jeremy from Geeks and Gamers and Star Wars Theory stand, but I do believe that Star Wars Theory has kind of uh, wanted to move away from Jeremy's very boisterous opinions and not get involved with the hoopla or the politics of it. And Star Wars Theory can do that. He has every right to choose and uh, what he, direction he wants to go. And that doesn't make him a bad guy at all. I love Star Wars Theory 100%. But Lucasfilm has been bashing fans for, for their criticisms for years. And now that it's knocking at his front door, I'm glad that Star Wars Theory finally... Uh, put his voice to the fight in in a very eloquent way to, you know, combat this from Pablo Hidalgo. I mean, first of all, this guy, Star Wars Theory, he can probably write better Star Wars in his sleep, second to none. I mean, than Pablo Hidalgo? And, I mean, I just, I can't understand why Lucasfilm endorses this, and not only endorses it, but I, I you know what, I'm going to say the word endorses, because they certainly don't do anything to, um, uh, censor or or kind of say, hey guys, you need to like be respectful of our fans no matter what their opinion is, no matter what your opinion is. They're our fans. They spend the money. They buy the toys. The only toys that I have bought in the last three years are these two beauties right here. I found the Razor Crest at Target and I found the ATST, both from The Mandalorian, uh, some while back. Now, when I... When I watched The Force Awakens, I bought two of every toy. When I watched the when I, before I watched The Last Jedi, I bought two of every toy and wished to God that I saved the receipt, but I didn't. But for people from Lucasfilm owned by Disney to talk shit on fans, it's not right. I, I can't imagine how a business tolerates this. I can't imagine it. I mean, we're just fans. We're trying to, you know, be reintroduced to Star Wars again. Some people are completely dead. Some people are like, nope, done. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna think about it. Uh, I'm not even gonna acknowledge it because they're gonna do something to screw us over. Well, here's something screwing us over. Can't believe what Pablo Hidalgo says. Can't believe that Lucasfilm allows it. Can't believe that Disney allows Lucasfilm to do this stuff to fans. It's not correct. And I think <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I mean, you know, geeks and gamers and everyone have been fighting this fight for three years. Star Wars theory don't want to get involved with it. That's his opinion that's his choice and i respect that but now he's getting involved i hope he continues to get involved with this because you can't you can't trash your fans man especially when disney is such in a dire uh state of their declining revenue nothing's being done nothing's being said i can't wait to see what kind of transpires after this what disney says or what lucasfilm comes out and says We'll see you guys. Take care. Make it your day. And as always, have fun. Bye, guys.